Uh, greetings. I, in my previous video, I did a uh, life advice. Uh, who who contacts you? Book. Um, This is the book I did. Um, the reason why I was doing this, um, that video was just clarification, was just to help people um, either reassess or reprioritize um, uh, people in their life and who to let in and, and who contact them, just to get an idea of um, who values you and who doesn't. Uh, it might help you self reflect and reprioritize. Um, I have to admit, after like, uh, I mean, after like two, uh, two weeks of doing that, I, I became extremely down. <laughs> so, because um, it involved a lot of deep self reflection and it was a uh, heartbreak and soul cushion. And um, it, there was, um, but there's more deep, deep understanding here as well. You are, um, Every person um, has free will and has a choice of the hours they have um, of who to contact and who they don't contact. Um, on average, the, a human being would sleep 8 hours. That would give 16 hours in a day to so choose how to do that time. You, you are limited about the amount of people you're in contact with on a daily basis because the more people you have to contact, the more hard it is to manage those connections. Um, so I I no longer... Um, it, it, it's, very, it's very good for you to understand why people contact you so that if you write it down, it gives you an indication if there's a pattern for your own for your own understanding and things of why you're contacting you with. The pattern seems to always be the case. It might help you identify like one-sided friendships or one-sided connections. Because um, if you're always making the effort, always solving others, and if it's always one way going, that is not healthy because anything requires two things to be built upon. But um, yeah, I, I stopped doing it about last one I did was on the 6th of December because I just I just couldn't write any more of people contact me who were not contact me and things. It was good for the first two weeks so that I got an idea it allowed me to self reflect and things of just um, I don't know if it's the case, I don't know if you have many people contact you and things but as far as I can resolve, most people contact people out reaction out of um, uh, reactions things. Um, I usually contact people just to check if they're still physically alive. <laughs> that's, that's the main reason why usually. And um, I'm. It's kind of hard because when you ring someone, you don't know at that very moment of time what they're doing. So. If, but as far as you can aware of, they could be at work, they could be on the toilet, and you don't want to ring someone up on toilet in case they drop the phone into the loo. <laughs> um, so, um, or they might be the talking to somebody, so they might not be in a time to have a conversation with you. Um, so, that's, I, I, I find it very navigating with, with phone calls. I usually just try to make phone calls with people and trying to make arrangements to meet up with the boss and, and um, make plans. Um, so that my idea was just to make that previous video and all just to help people. Say if there's someone who struggles with identifying um, connections that are that help that are actually genuine connections of, of people that are actually helping you and it's actually a friendship relationship that can flourish or if it's one that is just stagnating and it's one of just take 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 and drain 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 and it's yeah it, it's just uh it's just to help you reprioritize and value yourself for full contact you because you are the f average of five people you spend the most time with and the people who contact you if always, I say this to if you'll be a man or a woman, you should always take notes as the reason why people contact you 
and if every time they're contacting you is is for help or just it's or it's never to be a service it's for you to solve them then that's a red flag if it's constantly that way if you have like 10 conversations with someone it's always them reaching out to you and it's never them reaching out to you to ask them more like uh, hey ha, how's up is there any way i can help you is there any way i can solve you is there anything you need um or if it's always i'm stuck i'm in a pinch and um, because they know that you're the only one that's consistent in their life so and that they can ring up and if but if that's a consistent pattern it, it's it can be hard um if there was not um strong if not there's a foundation of boundary set and, and and it's okay to communicate with friends and loved ones about boundaries it, it's okay to set boundaries it, it's okay to communicate your your because every human has needs they have needs to, of love needs of, of of being wanted and needed and if it's always one-sided that's not healthy so I, I do pray that the previous video I did about life advice uh, may help people but just take on board because I forgot to do this in this video that if after a week or so if it causes you to have very strong emotions or um, causes you a lot of thoughts and things just to stop and and because it is quite hard when you when you reflect about the amount of people contact you and then you're going you'd be like maybe just one or two people you'd be looking a week or three people a week and this the same pattern seems to be the same um because you can do another book of of people you contact and the and if you compare the difference because i guarantee you if you have like one a book of people that that contact you and people that you contact i guarantee you the the book that you say that people you contact to be more because <laughs> a lot of times you uh, you have to take the initiative to reach out to people um but don't expect them to be consistent in reaching back out to you that's the thing uh, people choose who they prioritize um and I would recommend, and this is just my recommendation, but if to focus on prioritizing at least five people, just just out of five. If if you're blessed with five, just just five, because if you have more than five, it just makes it harder to maintain those connections. Um, that's just reality of the fact that we are limited. We're limited with our time, energy. In this life and that's something that you know, it's, it's very hard for me to process and, and kind of understand things but it's just true so yeah i do hope um the video i did previous about life advice of, of who contacts you might be a, of um benefit and help to others and thanks so much for watching this video